Hey everyone, this is J-Dog, and I'm here with another video. What you're looking at is a photo of a disgraced police officer, or should I say, a disgraced race soldier by the name of Daniel Patano. Patano. <clears throat> so what is he known for? He's known for the death of Eric Gartner. This is Eric Gartner's killer who used an illegal chokehold on an innocent man on on Eric Gartner and the worst I wish I wanted to happen was that he got charged and sent to prison or worse. Unfortunately that did not happen. He got off but this launched a number of protests, including the ones by Black Lives Matter, as well as the family of Eric Gartner, who hoped that the one thing that they also want of, uh, was to have him fired if they could not jail him, which I hope they still find a way to put charges on him to get him thrown to prison or worse. But, and... Well, even Eric Gardner's family said that even though this decision was made, the fight is not over for justice for Eric Gardner. But a police commissioner in, in, in New York has announced the firing of this murderer, this race soldier, Daniel Patalio. Patalio. He is a disgrace to mankind. Well, I don't think he's a human. He's a monster. He's not human. And I hope more bad luck and I hope more worse things come to him. I hope karma comes to him. It's already started with him losing his job. Of course, you got some defenders and his lawyer now I'm going to try to appeal the decision so he can get his job back or find somewhere else to work or to become an officer. So, but I'm at least glad that he is losing his job, that he is out of the police, of the race, of the police force. This is an example of a race soldier. He had no right killing. Eric Cartner was unarmed. And they tried to put on uh, destroy Eric Gartner's rep reputation by saying he was selling loose cigarettes. I found out that he was actually trying to stop a fight. And then he came in and did the illegal cho chokehold. And it's this should have happened sooner. Him losing his job should have happened sooner. It took nearly five years since the man's death to finally make sure that this race soldier loses his job. That's way too long. He should have lost his job way sooner. But at least he can't use his, his power as a race soldier. <sighs> So he'll, for right now, most likely be in the unemployment line. And I believe it, that I bet you that the pressure that was put on the police department, on the commissioner, and on the politicians over at New York was probably what helped led to the firing of this individual. And I say, for keep, we have to keep on the fight for justice for Eric Gardner. But that's all I have to say. This was just a short video on the update on the Daniel Patel, Eric Gardner situation. Although I do would like to see what you think in the comment section about this firing. And should more be done to make sure that true justice is given to Eric Gardner. Make sure you share this video. Like the video and subscribe if you haven't subscribed, depending on where you're watching this video. 
YouTube Black Junction whatsoever. But that's all I have to say for now. Thank you for watching. Also, I'll leave links to all the different accounts that you could follow me on from YouTube, Black Junction, etc. And um, I hope to catch y'all in another video. Peace, everyone.